What's up you guys? So this video is gonna be kind of quick. I wanted to show you one of the coasters that I did with Miss Scarlett not too long ago. Let me get a better view. So we did alcohol inks a few videos back and then we sprayed it with, do we varnish it first? We, yeah, we sealed it with the Camar Camar varnish. Mm -hmm. And then uh, we embossed it mm -hmm. with two different colors. So it has that like sparkly glitter, like Tiffany colored hat. And then the dude is black embossing powder. So check out a couple videos back for that. But I wanted to show you guys, after you do this, I would still want to seal it in with some clear resin. This is just Art Coat from Stone Coat Countertops. You can find it on our website, artistaldeath.com, or you can go directly to um, stonecoatcountertops.com. You can use the code YALL and get $10 off because who doesn't like to save a couple dollars here and there? I've got ink on my hands. So you want to make sure you do seal it in with a varnish that's UV protectant because any extra UV is amazing. Mm -hmm. And I would also make sure I seal it in with um, a resin because even though you spray it with a varnish, it still may be damaged. And it helps you protect it further. And you can use it as a coaster. And you can use it as a coaster because I don't know that embossing, I don't know the heat that it could withstand. I don't know how alcohol inks do with a whole bunch of heat, but I do know that stone coats, art coat, and countertop coat resin um, can withstand 500 degrees Fahrenheit. It also brings the color out a little bit more. Mm -hmm. Don't forget when you use resin to hit it with a little bit of heat to pop any bubbles that may have been mixed into it. You don't want to use too much heat because that will thin out your resin and it will run off of your coaster. Also, get a wax paper, parchment paper, butcher paper. If you get a butcher paper, make sure it's shiny side up. And you can leave that flat in your dust-free area and just peel that off and not have to worry about little like bumps on the bottom side. Mm -hmm. And I personally use UV archival spray. Instead of the camar? Yeah. I just, I think it's the same, honestly. As long as it doesn't have like an alcohol base in it, it's yeah. not going to disturb I just know your... those two for sure won't reactivate your alcohol ink at all. That is what is important. Anyways, you guys, I hope you learned something and um, we will see y'all on the next video. Don't forget to read all the stuff over here. Till next time. Bye. Bye. I said bye. <laughs> you said bye. Sorry.